Hi, this is Tamika with Pisces Pumps and Pie, and I'm here with a Plan With Me video for the YouTube collab loop group. I am a part of two different groups for the YouTube collab groups. They are formed by Lisa Marie over at Creatively Lisa Marie on YouTube and socials. And so shout out to her and thanks to her for putting these groups together. Um, you may have seen my video from last week and our theme was nautical. I really enjoy putting together that spread. And our theme for this week is travel. So at first, I thought I knew what I was going to do for travel. But a few weeks ago, I had saw um, a post on Instagram from the washi tape shop. And it was an interesting Dutch door spread. And I had said, oh, I'm going to try that in my in my um, creative journal. And then I remembered that this week was going to be travel. And I said, that's a perfect time for me to try that type of Dutch door. So I'm going to be using Going Places by Wrong Wrong. I'm also going to be using some of her Mambi sticks and I've already taken out some of the stickers that I want to use and I've separated them here in one of her sticker uh, storage albums. I may use some letters from this alphabet book by Happy Planner. Not sure about that yet, but I'm not going to do as many Dutch door pages as I saw on that Instagram post. I'm only going to do two. And so I said, travel is perfect for me to try this out because the Dutch doors were like Polaroids and this would be like the photos you take on your vacation so I'm excited about it I've already drawn out my boxes which I didn't do a fabulous job with that but I don't even care because I'm just really excited about putting this spread together I'm gonna go ahead and go back over everything in black ink and then I'm gonna cut out along the Dutch door here right so I'm not gonna cut this little space here but I am gonna cut out along here and then this is what will be seen when you come to the next page so I do have a little notes on there for myself and then I'm gonna fill in some things with some of the Mambi sticks and the stickers of course that I have um, in the sticker storage album so whoops because I can't find one of my rulers and the one ruler I can find, I, I don't use that ruler often and it's hard for me to even do what I want to do with it. So I'm going to go with this. <laughs> I have a paper towel so I can kind of wipe it clean as I use it. But yeah, we're going to use this and go along here and get our lines all nice and traced out so I know Dutch doors are very very popular I it's not something that I try often and I've tried them before in my business journal which is also a dot grid journal I tried Dutch doors in there before tried them in my fitness bujo journal which I haven't used in a while um, I've tried them in there but they're time consuming <laughs> it's it's pretty time consuming to do Dutch doors um, one thing that is very helpful with them especially like if I use them in my fitness bujo journal then I don't have to decorate every single week I can just use the whatever I do with those Dutch doors to decorate it for the entire month. So I have not used my fitness booster journal in a while. And what I'm thinking is because I don't really get a lot of views on those videos. And so what I was thinking is just do my monthly setup and just do it for the whole month instead of doing my weeklies every week just show my monthly setup and keep it moving um, that's what I'm thinking about for that and then maybe I could do like a reel once a month 
for one of the weekly spreads. And then that would allow me to incorporate more Dutch doors since I'm not an artist like that. You know what I mean? I'm not a super artist. I really didn't even need to wipe that out because now that I think about it, I'm going to be cutting it. Um, but since I'm not like a super great artist, Dutch Doors does help me do something that is artistic and not have to do it every single week. So yeah, I'm really excited about this theme. Hopefully, I won't take 10 years to do it because I'm contemplating I'll probably fast forward myself cutting for sure because my goodness, I'm going to be so laser focused when I do that. I do want to white out this little dot because I am going to use this space. Okay. Yeah, I know a lot of these lines are just like not perfect, especially some of the ones that I drew like at an angle. I know I did not do those angles well. <laughs> I know I didn't. That's okay. Let me go ahead and while I'm already outlining everything, just continue to do that and then I'll come back and cut that page out but one thing I just thought about just now is I'm glad there's a travel theme because I really wanted to do some traveling this year for summer and that's not gonna happen so at least I can travel vicariously through my planner right now whoops Ooh, I'm messing up So yeah, I can just kind of travel vicariously through the planner. <laughs> yeah, that's what we're going to do this summer. And the great thing about me selecting that wrong, wrong book is because there's so many travel destinations that are represented in that sticker book. And so I said, well, that's great. I can make a lot of different Polaroids based on that so I'm happy but then I was trying to just figure out like which stickers do I want to use and I remembered you have the wrong wrong sticker storage book how about you actually use it because I've I have not used it since I bought it and so I was like okay and this is the second one I think she made I know right now she just came out with some refills and stuff so, um, yeah, because this one is the Christmas theme one. And so that goes to show you how long I've had it and I haven't used it. <laughs> well, we know it'll be Christmas again. Speaking of Christmas, I'm going to shout out my shop right now. We are having Christmas in July. Every Friday of this month, I am releasing new Christmas cards. All of my cards are handcrafted Christmas, handcrafted cards, all handcrafted by me. Nothing is mass produced unless I mass produce it. <laughs> and so there is a discount code you can use right now, which is July Christmas. And that will save you 10% off of a $10 purchase on any Christmas cards. All of your support is so appreciated. Um, you know, it is a very small business. It's a very new business. And I know it's not planner stickers. I know. But we all send greeting cards for something at some point in the year. And a lot of us do send out Christmas cards. So get the Christmas cards while you can. There's no guarantee that the Christmas cards that we have for the July sale will be back for the regular Christmas release. It's just going to depend on how the sales go. 
and that will determine if I will recreate any of those same cards for the Christmas season. Now keep in mind even if I recreate something it may not be exactly like the original depending on what materials I still have available. But yeah, my work is very extensive and laborious because it took me the card. One of the cards I posted recently was the layered candy cane card. Out. I was explaining to my mom how long it took me to do those. Just to put the candy canes together, I had two, four, six, eight candy canes. To put the candy canes together took me a good three, four hours just to put those together. That did not that did not include any of the other things on there. <laughs> it took a long time, but they came out so nice. So it's always worth it in the end to see how pretty the cards are. So just gonna white out some of these parts. Now I'm going to go in and I'm going to cut my Dutch door. Now I'm very afraid of this part because I'm just not, I don't have the patience for cutting. <laughs> but I'm gonna have to do that right now. So y'all wish me well. I'm gonna speed this one up. Yeah, I'll be back. Okay, so that's done and what I just realized is that I probably should have drawn more on the back but I'm gonna try and put a sticker back here is what I want to try and do so let me take these scraps I don't like throwing away scraps but I'm gonna put them in my scraps of cardstock and stuff okay so I'm going to begin by filling out this page and this page I wanted to put her and then this quote so let's go ahead and do that now these mamby sticks I don't know if you'll be able to find these anywhere they are from a while back when wrong wrong first started working with happy planner some years ago so don't know you might try Joanne I know a lot of the Mamby sticks in themselves are still being sold at Joanne so you might be able to find them there and then I also wanted to use this living my best life quote Ooh, that's gonna be I don't know, That's that might not work, it's pretty big. So we're gonna put this one back. That's not, I'm not gonna be able to use that. So, maybe we'll have to find something else to go here. I really wanted that one. Let's do this, It's since it's called travel, this one says find the joy and find the joy in the journey. So let's put this one and that's going to have to be trimmed. So let's trim this. Okay. And then we'll burnish this down. great and maybe just maybe I could find something here let's see let's go ahead and put these leaves those would work down here okay those work all right 
So that page is taken care of. Now, I wanted to try, and since this is travel and I'm doing these Dutch doors and we're talking Polaroids, I felt that this girl needed to be on the page. So I was hoping she would fit here, and she does. So she's going to just be cut off just a little bit at the top and at the bottom there. So let's trim this. And then we'll trim down there as well. I'm so happy I was able to get her to fit. Because <laughs> I was like, Wait a minute, she's holding a camera. It's just perfect for her to be a part of this because we're doing a Polaroid Dutch door. Now, one thing I haven't decided is washi because I'm going to have so many different colors and stuff going on. But I think to make this look good, I might try and trim that with some florals or something. I'll, I'll try and find something. So yeah, that was, I think, everything I wanted to use off of the Mambi sticks. So now let's start doing the rest of our stuff here. So let me erase this because like I said, I made myself some notes. <laughs> okay, so we're going to take her... And so I might have to trim, which is fine. I anticipate having to do that. But let me see. We've got this slot first. So let's put this here. And then we'll put her... her in the middle. So I'm going to trim. Okay. Oh. There's that. And then this down here girl you got this and then we'll put the leaves there and I have this cute quote it says hola bonita and I might can cut it and get it to fit here so there's the hola part whoops crooked Bonita. And I might still be able to use that heart. I wasn't sure. So let's go ahead and grab that up. All right. Oh my gosh. I love it. Ah, I love it. I love it. I love it. All right. Next. So let me, let's go with our next one. And this one. I'm going to do this girl. And then I had like the Eiffel Tower and the Arc the Triumph to put in the background. Okay. 
think I might have cut that pretty deep. Y'all know I have a problem with cutting things deep. Okay. Oh my gosh, it looks cool. And then I have here that says bonjour. Bonjour. Comment allez-vous? Comment tu t'appelles? All right. Lovely. See, I did pull her before, but when I, I did, because I didn't know if I had a, a larger version of her, and I said, go to your Mambi sticks. And I did, and my Mambi sticks, I had a larger one. I was so happy. All right. I may not be able to use all of this stuff that I pulled, but that's okay. So, let's go here so I'm going to put this here you know what let me burnish that down and then we're going to put these ladies I think these are turning out so nice. I just need stuff to put behind these two girls, and I didn't really know what to put behind them. Um, let's put this quote, live in the moment. We can fit that in there. Yeah, that works. Live in the moment. So cool. Okay. Next, I'm going to do the New York scene. Okay. This says, Get it, babe, which I think is so funny and cute. That's what the street sign says Get it, babe. Now, I want this to be in the background. Maybe I won't get both of the girls. But she seems very New York. Let me put this back. But so does she. She's got the sex in the city vibe. Ooh, no. Alright. I want to get them both on here, but I also want that taxi cab in the back so I'm gonna put the taxi cab like up here and I want it kind of in the background of them so I put her here I'm gonna have to cut off quite a bit of her which is okay and I'm gonna have to cut off quite a bit of her as well so let's just do it because we don't have a choice if we want to fit them in here. Okay. Oh, I knew this blade was loosening up. You can kind of feel it sometimes when it's doing that. And that's dangerous because this sucker's sharp. Okay, what I'm going to do is cut around her like that. That way I can remove... this piece of taxi that's right through her head <laughs> let's remove that it's not too bad with her because her hair is dark but it was a problem here all right 
Oh my gosh, I'm loving this so, so much. Let's close this up so we don't cut ourselves. Okay. I'm gonna put that there. Okay, and then we've got these girls. Wait, 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 what was here? Oh, did I skip some girls somewhere? Yeah, these girls go here. I'll come back and put them there. I was like, wait a minute. I'm going to put that there. I feel like I should overlap it since everything else is overlapped. And maybe this one is overlapped a little too much. Okay, so let's pull that one. Put that one like this and do this one like that and so we've got these girls tell you I'll be cutting deep with these utensils the same way I cut deep when I tell people the truth oh help me lord <laughs> oh help me lord I always tell people I will cut you and you won't even bleed and I won't even have to use a weapon <laughs> god help me all right so there's that now let's go back over here and finish off this one. I don't know how I missed this. I think I was just so excited. All right. So, so for these girls. Oh, that's the side we don't want it to stick on. This is not the sticky side. I think her newer ones are sticky on both sides, but this one is not. So I gotta be careful with that. So let's see, we can put her here. Oh, no, oh, that's not right. there she needs to go like in the background because she's further away this one the way I want it, huh? I want her to come more over this way. I was trying to keep her cup in there, but we're probably going to have to cut out her cup. And then we're going to put that little basket there. And then I had this one that says time to wonder. And we're going to put that there. So let's trim this one. This one's going to be a little harder to see. Okay. And then, okay, I can see through the pants there. Okay. All right. 
right, I think that looks so good. There were so many more stickers I wanted to add. But I don't want to have to cut out more Dutch doors. And that's what I would have to end up doing. Um, this girl, I wanted to use this, but I don't have room. I was going to use her and then put the smaller one onto that. But I just don't have the room for it. I wonder if I can take this, cut it up, and put it along here. Chase the sun. Maybe I could do it this way. Chase the sun. Let me do that. Let's do that. And I'm going to try to be very light with this because I don't want to ruin... I don't want to ruin this. Um, oh, no, I'm not cutting straight. We're going to have to do this another way because I'm gonna really butcher this I know me so let's go ahead and cut out Sun okay and then we'll cut out oh my god I am totally butchering this y'all like, totally Cutting too close. Oh goodness. Okay. So let's go back over here. Chase the so we'll put chase here to center it and that helps take up some of that space that's there we're just gonna put this oh. right here okay Chase the sun, and I think there's just a little smidgen of that here. I can't get it it's so tiny. Okay. Oh wow, I think that worked pretty well. Um I want to use this going places sticker also. And I'm just going to put it up here and just layer it right there over the top of her hat. So let's just do that. Okay. There's that. Let me see. Like I said, I don't really have room to fit in anything else. Um, let's go back in this book and let's see what we can find. So, a lot of what I have left in here is very functional. Um, I could put a bathing suit. Down here in the corner. I want to put something here. I don't remember there being really any florals in here. Which florals would be great there? Oh, I do need to do some more trimming. I just realized so I do need to trim along here Okay, so I 
think. everything trimmed yeah everything's trimmed oh my god I'm loving this I just wish I had some florals to fill in here and maybe some to put right there I don't think there's any in this book um but I do know where I maybe could find some and another wrong wrong book some florals okay let's do this I don't want this whole thing so let's do let use a straight edge because y'all know I'm just not good with this helps a little bit there um, I don't know if I want to try to put anything along here and along here I think I might just leave it I really want to put stuff along the sides but I don't I don't know I think I need to just leave it alone all right I think that's gonna do it so let's just move everything out of the way so we can have one final look at our travel spread so we have this Dutch doors using wrong wrong going places and wrong wrong Mambi sticks. I let me apologize right now if I was ever out of frame because I do get laser focused. So sorry about that. So we have a wrong wrong Mambi sticks. All of these are Mambi sticks here except for these two. And I just feel like she had to go there, you know? She just had to. So we made this picture with the woman in her swimsuit and she's in a tropical place then we have this lady here she's in France and Paris she's got the Eiffel Tower there and the Arc de Triomphe and she's got a beret and she's just enjoying things she's got a bouquet of flowers these two girls are somewhere nice and fun, maybe I like the countryside. They've got a little basket of goodies, basket tote of goodies there. And then we have the Arthur <laughs> of this Dutch Doors. She's the woman behind the camera. <laughs> She's taking the photos and so I've used some of those different photos from the book. I could see if there's anyone, any more of those smaller women that I could add in here to make it even more interesting. But then we have these ladies, these Moroccan themed ladies, the New York ladies. So we've got East Coast and then we've got West Coast. So let me check one more thing since I just thought about it. Um, if I have any of the ladies that would fit in these two scenes. Let's just double check. So oh, it looks like these ladies go. So maybe her. So let me raise this up. Let me raise that up. 
and then I can just add her there just cover that like that and I don't know if we maybe have a girl small enough to go there yeah these page these boxes were made for layering the girls on top which I plan to do some of that but I don't have the space and like I said I didn't want to draw more boxes so She would look good there but she's the exact same girl here you see they're very similar so I don't want to do that otherwise I would have put her down so I think we're gonna be good here see there she is again but yeah all right we're done then that's gonna be it so I really enjoyed doing this I don't do Dutch doors often but I'll try to remember to link the Instagram post below that gave me inspiration for this that way if this is something you would like to try you can go ahead and try it and hopefully you can draw your boxes better than I drew them but uh, this is the spread that I have for you so before you go make sure you check out the description box below because you were either directed here through the loop group or you started here and if you go in the description box there will be the link for the next video and then same thing on each person's video you go in their description you'll keep getting the link to the next one so once you've gotten back to where you started then you know you've gone through the entire loop group make sure when you go to each video you show these planners some love like comment subscribe share it goes so far for them for you to just do those simple little things show them a lot of a lot of love especially for this theme because i'm i'm very interested to see to see what everyone's gonna have for this theme all right also again shout out to lisa marie over at creatively lisa marie for putting the loop groups together and guys don't forget to slay subscribe like and accept the alerts so you don't miss any videos and i'll see you in the next one Bye bye